Okay, in this video I'm going to show you how easy it is to get your mailer up and running. So the first thing you want to do is log into your mailer. Um, all you do is click on the link and put in your username and password and once you do that it'll bring you to this page right here. And this is actually the upload screen where you actually upload your Excel CSV lead file. So what you want to do before you actually do that is open up your lead file and make sure everything's in the correct format to load into the mailer. So the first thing you want to do is add titles here. So for example if your leads don't have this information at the top such as the word email and the word name you want to make sure you add that in there and any other information that your leads might ha have for example phone number and um, basically those are the usually the only three I really use so just make sure your leads have that information at the top here and if they don't all you do is click on the first box here and then right click on your mouse and choose insert and it, as you can see it'll add a new row but since it's already there we'll just delete it and just make sure your email address is in the first column here and what you want to do then is just hit file save as save it as um, a CSV file you, you do that by clicking the drop down menu here it'll normally be an Excel workbook file but you just have to scroll down and find the CSV comma delimited click save and yes now what you can do is close that now you can actually go to the browse button here find the lead file on your computer you have to make sure you go wherever you save it at if you have it in your documents or your desktop just make sure you find it and then double click on it and as you can see it puts it right in there now what you want to do is check this box right here it says file uses title row and then you click upload file and then just give it a minute and it's gonna upload for you and now what it's done is bring, brought you to the actual mailer itself and all you do here is type in your name your email address and you do that for the same um, you do that for the the bounce email address also you can you can use the same email address or you can make up another email just for that and here what you want to do is enter a subject line and in the big box here this is where your message goes now you can also um, put people's information throughout the message so for example if you want to put the person's name if you want to say hi and then put this click on this little um, button right here it'll put the person's name right there so wherever you see this right here this will put that person's name right there and then you can do the same thing for any of these other ones that you may want to use so basically you put your message there and you also want to make sure you include a way to unsubscribe and you just write a little short message like something like this okay so something like that just um, to unsubscribe reply with unsubscribe in the subject and what 
you want to do also is put your mailing address because anytime you mail um, mass send emails you have to include a physical address for a person to unsubscribe so if you have a PO box you can put that um, or just put your regular address and then you know just put that information right there and once you do that you're all ready to start sending make sure you keep the send rate at 45 don't change that because if you do you'll risk going over the hosting company's limit which will cause them to terminate or suspend your account so make sure you keep that at a low rate uh, or actually at that rate right there or lower and once you're ready once you verify everything and check over everything just click start sending and what you can do here is you can leave this window open or you can um, close this window and you know come back and um, it'll let you know as the um, emails are going out this number will get lower and lower so um, just depending on how many emails you have will depend on how long it takes to send out so um, it sends about hundred and eighty an hour so just um, you know based your messages going out off of that that's pretty much how it works and um, if you have any other support issues just uh, send a support ticket and we'll get you uh, get your questions answered.